Hey guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting right to episode 10 of My Senpai is Annoying. So let's go ahead and get started in 3, 2, 1, go. Mm -hmm, I have breaking tummy. I want to die. Ugh. And some ginger ale. <laughs> you got this. How much did you gain? Oh, baby. You gained a lot, didn't you? Oh, she can tell. I've reached euphoria. <laughs> Boy, if you don't. Mm. It just tastes my lip gloss. <laughs> on the diet. <laughs> really? <laughs> yeah, you know, sweet potatoes, any type of food. <laughs> yeah. 
I don't know why, but even though I haven't eaten yet, looking at that makes me want to throw up. <laughs> She works at your job. Hey, she probably got a stomach. When it's us women, we are determined. And when we hungry, like, oh. Like, you know, honestly, I would love to go to a buffet, but, like, since I'm vegetarian, I couldn't eat meat. <laughs> so probably the whole time I'd just be able to eat salad. Or maybe that would be that one time, but, like, fuck it, I'm eating meat today. <laughs> oh. Well, you want some help? It's still a good shooter, though, Cosmo. Mm, Fall through. Nice. So you got this, Yuto. Mm -hmm. Make sure to kind of jump since you are a little shorter. Oh, damn! Pizza sounds good. No. <laughs> oh, and you thought they were also going to be cold. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Futaba, are you jealous, babe? Oh. <laughs> yeah. She's so cute when she's jealous. Because it looks like you want some. Mm hmm. <laughs> Just, I love the fact that he can read her like an open book. Oh. 
<laughs> oh, that looks so good. I still look good, though. So you're just making me hungry. Uh, after this, I'm eating my lunch. <laughs> my late lunch. <laughs> You know what? I'd probably put in a rice bowl, like either some vegetarian tuna or it just something good. I can still eat me some eggs. So I don't know. Would you want to put like stuffed eggs in a rice ball? I mean, with a rice ball, you can put anything in it. <laughs> I mean, hold on, isn't that a little unfair? That's three on two. <laughs> I'm just ready to see Futaba get this. Oh, <laughs> uh, Jesus. Really? Oh, come on now. Just because she's a girl doesn't mean you need to put your distance. Because <laughs> you know she's going to play you. <laughs> gotcha. <sighs> Never underestimate a woman. Oh, poor baby. <laughs> For <Tom. laughs> Go, you too, go, baby. Best baby. You can. Hmm? 
Shoot! Oh! Oh. Poor baby. He tried, though. A for effort. Yeah. Ah, uh, yes, that play by play. <laughs> oh, damn, y'all okay? Nice moons. <laughs> ah. Distraction. <laughs> <laughs> mm. Oh, is that her? Okay. No, baby.
No, yeah, eating right, working out, mm, more milk in your diet. Mm, a veggie hot dog sounds good, but it <laughs> I just want my food. I'm hungry. <laughs> yeah. She she fun, she fun size. She not gonna grow out of it. <laughs> oh, you don't. Mhm. Mm she just fun size, baby. You you adorable and fun size and you sweet and then it's okay to be fun size like oh my god it's the best thing in the world even though I'm not one of those I am like <sighs> comparing myself to a candy so okay if fun size is a shorter one and a regular size like candy bar is like the average person I'm king size because I am tall as fuck so. <laughs> I love the fact that, like, Sakura was like, you know, mm -mm. Kazumi, come with me! Because <laughs> she wanted alone time with them, like, oh, just like how, you know, Futaba got jealous that, you know, <laughs> her co-workers got to eat pork buns and she wasn't invited. And so, but like I said, I love the fact that he is able to read her like a freaking book and know exactly what in the world she wants. It's so obvious with her sometimes. Even though these two aren't in a relationship, but they have a lot of flirting moments with each other. See, I need this show to have a second season. We're not even done with this show, and I just freaking need the show to have a fucking second season. I will be so freaking happy or ecstatic. Even if we get an OVA, they could do it lo like Love is Hard for Otaku and just give it a whole bunch of OVAs instead of a season two. But I would rather have a season two instead of having, like multiple OVAs throughout like the last few years for that show because I think like what they're they just did like their last I'm guessing their last OVA like not too long ago even though I haven't watched it yet but of course since Amazon or specifically my prime on Amazon I don't think they have that on there so you know I have to do some other things to watch it but I mean still going to seeing everybody like be there for Yuto and to help him with basketball. That was freaking cute. Oh my god. Before baby. Like. He literally. <laughs> he literally. He was, I was like. Okay. Yeah. You got this. Gumba. <laughs> Gumba. Day. And he just. I'm like. Alright. Follow through. Follow through. Get that thing up there. Do that swoosh. And he went. Douche. And it hit Cosmo in the face. Like that. <laughs> and then. Oh my god. <laughs> but it was so good. I'm hungry. I need to go eat. Um, 
But yeah, I really enjoyed this episode. Very fun. Honestly, when it's the whole group together, straight up, um, it makes the episode a little more fun. I mean, I, I love the moments between, you know, Futaba and her Shampai and everybody else and stuff. But when they're all together and they get to do stuff as a group, even with last week's beach episode going on into this week's, like, oh, let's help Yuto with basketball and everything, it makes you wonder with, I think we have two more weeks with this show left. I think this will be done by Christmas, I believe. Um, it makes you wonder with these last two episodes, what in the world is going to go on? Especially, like, you know, with Futaba and her senpai's relationship. Are they going to move forward continuously as friends? Are they going to go into more than friends and officially date our Kazuma and Sakura? Are they going to date by the end of this series? There's still, like, a lot of will-they-won't-they they moments. And so, hopefully, within these last few weeks of this show... But we get our answers. But other than that, guys, that is my reaction view towards episode 10 of My Senpai is Annoying. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Matchless Squad. And, of course, I will see you guys officially all next Saturday. Hopefully, I don't have to work next Saturday. But we ain't going now for episode 10. Bye, guys. I mean, episode 10. Episode 11. Bye, guys. <laughs>